Hey everyone, today we're with the Cosmopolitan Club here at Thirsty's where they meet and we're with Chuck, the president, so thanks for joining us. Thank you. Now we can't miss you because you're in all yellow, so yes. talk a little bit about what your club does. Okay, our club is, uh, we're part of Cosmopolitan International mm -hmm. and our, our goal, our mission is to fight diabetes. And uh, we, on an international level, have given over $7 million to the fight, the research uh, di uh, diabetes. Uh, here on a local level, we, we give back every, every year to our community. We raise funds for uh, Diabetes Inc. and also other organizations that service uh, the community. Sure. So this last year, we gave uh, $40,000 back. Wow. Yes. And then how are you raising those funds? Uh, we do uh, several fundraisers. Our major fundraiser is the Sportsman Show that we uh, have every February, middle of February. Mm -hmm. We do that with the Shriners and Jim uh, Skull. And then we also do the Summer Nights, checking IDs. Uh, and then we are the we usher quite a few events over at the Monument Center. Mm -hmm. And uh, we do the hockey, we usher theater, scan the concert tickets, we help out the stock show. So we help out about every event there. Why was it important for you to be a part of this organization? Well, I know that diabetes is one of the biggest concerns we have over 38 million Americans have diabetes, uh, 93 that are pre-diabetic. We meet every Monday here at Thursdays. We meet uh, to have lunch, go over, we have a program, go, go over what's going on. Do you know how long Cosmos has been a thing in like Rapid City? Since 1929, 93 years. Wow. Yes. Now, if somebody was like, hey, that sounds like a cool club to join, how, do, how what would they do? Uh, several different ways. Uh, you see us ushering over at the Monument Center. We don't wear the yellow jackets anymore. We wear the monument tops. Okay. But we're the, still the same people. Just grab us there, talk to us. Mm -hmm. uh, you are certainly welcome to come to a meeting uh, on Mondays. We might even buy your lunch. Okay. Um, then we have a, a website. Uh, just type in Rap City Cosmopolitan Club. We It's Club Runner. And then we also have a Facebook page. We are always looking for volunteers. Uh, new blood and we only ask a couple of things that you have a passion to fight diabetes and like to have fun perfect awesome all right well thanks chuck well thank you we're here now with aaron from diabetes inc thanks for joining us thank you for having me and now your organization benefits from the cosmopolitan club is that correct yes we do we benefit a lot from them they're one of our largest supporters they've helped us a lot they help us with our camp for kids and our type 1 diabetic event for our kids and mm -hmm. adolescents. Okay, talk about what Diabetes Inc. is here in Rapid City. Absolutely. So we are a nonprofit and we are a nonprofit in Rapid City, but we are throughout the Black Hills and we support anyone who wants to come to any of our events. Yeah, and we want to give educational services and we're looking into giving more financial services to type 1 diabetic kids and their families. So, um, for example, we have a camp every year in August mm -hmm. for families and their type 1 kids. And then we also do, um, like we did the Spearfish corn maze and pumpkin patch, and we pay for them to go and just enjoy and have fun and be part of a community. Okay. Why was it important for you to get behind this effort? Well, my background is in education and working with children and nonprofit. And so I loved all of it, and I love camps, and I love being with children, and I feel like diabetes is something that is close to my heart because I've had children in my class with type 1 diabetes, and I see what happens in their families and the struggles that they go through, and I just feel like it was important for me to be part of the organization, and I absolutely love it. The Cosmo Club, since they're a diabetes organization, are, they are our number one supporters. And so we'd like to support them also by helping um, usher. But if we didn't have them and we didn't have their contribution, then we wouldn't have Camp for Kids. We wouldn't have Type 1 events. We do get grants and we do have fundraisers. We have a Taste of Caring every year um, in April. And so if we didn't have um, the Cosmo Club, I don't think we would be here. Yeah, wow, it's a big impact. Yeah, they're a huge impact. Yeah, um, so then talk about if folks wanted more information on your organization, you know, where would they go or what would oh, yeah. they do? So we have a Facebook and we have Instagram and we have a website, diabetesincorporated.org. Thanks, Erin. Thank you. Yeah.